Dun, 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 dun. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Art Trooper with you, and today, cutting all the jokes around, I have a special video for you guys and another tutorial. And this will be very good if you want to trade with villagers, villagers that are shepherds, and if you want to make lots and lots of beds, or collect lots of wool. So, what I have for you guys is an automatic wool, wool farm. Hope you guys enjoy. Let's show you right now. Okay, so you guys, this is an automatic wool farm. And it basically farms wool for yourself <laughs> so um let's turn this off i'm gonna show you how to build this right now it's really efficient um you might want to get ready to lose a few of the sheeps because of this block over here it's the magma block well, as you know if you have played minecraft for a while um you're gonna get damage if you stand on that block and so will the mobs so um first of all you want to have like a breeding space for the sheep so that one day so that you have plenty of um sheep and you can keep replenishing the machine and you gotta get ready for that you're gonna lose a few sheep, so yeah. I had a lot of them, I'm gonna um, die, but still, it's worth it. First of all, if you haven't seen the previous tutorial video, this is part of the video. It's a hidden secret door for your base. It's really good. For your survival world if you're playing on servers or with your friends or whatever you want to do it's really good to have it so without any blabbing anymore let's get straight to the build and of all let's make this 10 blocks okay let's make it 15. Two more to the side. Now I'm gonna break this here. We'll put the dispenser right here, facing towards you. Then you're going to put soul sand here, and you're going to put redstone dust. Let me get it. I had it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put that some dust on top of the dispenser, but first of all, let's put grass here. I'm gonna put it here. So here and here. And then you're going to put um redstone here, here, here. And you put a block here. You break this one, I forgot. And you place another one with a gap of just one block. So, throw redstone all around. And now, you will put redstone torches in each side over here 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 and here and let's put some more redstone dust I think I did it wrong let me go check you're supposed to put 
on top and now it's going to start to shoot really fast and for that we're gonna have a lever you put the lever here turn it off and inside you're going to put a shear or as many shears as you want um and now you're going to put a magma block right in here and you're going to make this five blocks high now you're going to put grass blocks in here until you leave a space of just one block so now you're going to get signs here and just in case put it one on another one here another one here and here as well so now I'm gonna go up I'm gonna put one here and here and here and here so now you're going to put water on the top and it's gonna start to flow to flow to flow let's put some more water here let's see okay perfect and now you put it here and it didn't stop so let's put a block now it's working so now you're going to take water and put it right here and that's perfect so you basically got your rolling system made so now we're going to work under here beneath the, the block so first of all break one two and three and break one and two so basically you're gonna be under here one two three one and two so perfect now we're going to Break here and here as well. You're going to put first of all the chest, the chest, so we don't, so you don't make the error I made here and here. And if you want, you can break here for a for a moment. Put the dispenser facing the chest, and now, I mean the hopper facing the chest. Now you can put the grass block here and you will put a, a normal rail here and two powered rails, one on each side. Oh, I forgot. You can put a redstone block right here and put the, the powered rail there and you could put the block of redstone here. So now, you can put your minecart with hopper right in the middle. You can push it and it will start rolling by itself where it's supposed to. So, if it didn't, we're gonna check this out. Why? So let's put uh, the block of that's on here and the block of grass right here let's try it right now let's see okay now it's working so now 
we're gonna make this function right now let's put some sheeps and see how it works first of all let's cover this part so as you can see it's going down there they're going and they stopped because there's not enough sheep inside Okay, so they're gonna keep going down. The point is, when they get here, I didn't have this on. It's gonna start shooting the shears, and it's gonna get down there. Um. So apparently, I did an error again. Um, it might happen. I'm sorry. Let's just fix it fast. Let's so put a block of this on here and here put grass box here you put a hopper facing this way put a rail here and powered rails and your minecart with the hopper gonna go right here and it keeps on going let's see if it started yes perfect so um, we're gonna put a few more sheeps and have it run for a, more, a little more first of all let's cover this up Okay, so right now it's running a bit better. They're actually dying right there because they're not moving. So you might want to put more, um, more sheep's, and try to get rid of if you have snow. Try to get rid of the of that snow because it's actually going to make the grass die. And you don't want that. You want the sheep to eat the grass so they can have wool. So, my advice to you is try to break that snow if you can. Okay, so that is basically it, you guys. Let's see how much um, wool we have here. Uh, let's try to lower this. Sorry for this. Um... Okay, so let's check, and we have lots of stuff. Lots of wool, we have lots of mutton, and that actually works on both sides. On the mutton and on the wool. So, try to have a farm of sheep, and then have a farm of wool. So you can have both. So you can also replenish the... Um, Sheeps you lose when they die. And let's check. And this will often happen. But it still is going to work well. Let's try and fix this fast enough and see if breaking this. Um, okay, I put it bad. Okay, let's put them here. Now it's working a bit better. So if it doesn't work for you guys, you can break some of the signs and let the water flow better. It actually works well even if the water isn't flowing fast. But, as I said, have two farms, a farm for breed, breeding ships, sheep, and another farm of wool. 
this will be it for you um, for this video um, if you actually liked um, the idea please leave a, leave a like comment and subscribe share with your friends and also hope you guys have a great day night morning whatever you have whatever time it is at where you live love you guys take care please wash your hands stay safe you don't want to catch what is going around the world right now so love you guys see you on the next video and i'll make the next tutorial video even better take care goodbye <laughs>